Tomorrow is the first day of the second term. Use it high to school. Morning. Morning. Good morning. Summer vacation's over already. Yep. Yo, guys. I got lost on my way here. Really, man? Summer wasn't that long. Vacation was pretty long. Not that long. Sheesh. I would see you on that one. Hmm. Good morning. Good morning. Y you? You're that, uh, pint-sized detective. Did you have to call him that? I beg your pardon? My name is Naoto. Please don't give people bizarre nicknames you make up on the spot. Um... You know this is a high school, right? My cooperation with the police has come to an end. However, there are aspects of the case with which I remain unconvinced. There are some family-related issues as well, so I've decided to stay here for the present. Hmm, okay. From today forth, I'll be a first year at your high school. Really? You're going to school here now? And I felt that I should at least introduce myself to you all. I trust our relations will be cordial, Senpai. Senpai? Detective boys are underclassmen? Yep. Yes. So they got the guy on a summer break. I was sad to know that he was a student. I once taught, really? Do you soon teach him? Have you? You've got a lot so for in suspect in dus I can't fucking say it. <laughs> Moving on. I'm so you know what I mean. You all watch gossip shows. You never know who has a grudge against you. Very true. Oh, great pop quiz. When was soccer first introduced in the Olympics? Uh, <laughs> what's the answer? <laughs> I actually am not sure. Nineteen hundreds. You gave the answer you thought was right. That's right. Good job. So let's get kicking. Split into two teams. And don't hurt yourself. And don't hurt yourselves, guys. Remember, the school trip is only a week away. We have a school trip coming up.
you answer correctly, and all this is increased, if only it maxed out, that would have been even better. Man, school's as dull as ever. Usually is, though. With the case closed, the days feel so empty all of a sudden. Come on, Yosuke. Everything went back to normal. It's a good thing. I didn't mean it that way. It's just... Hey, we're stopping by Juness later, right? Why don't we ask Naoto-kun to join us? Oh, well, I just thought, since he doesn't know anyone yet, he must feel lonely. Didn't he say he came here to help out with the murder case? With the case closed, he's just an ordinary guy now. And if you think about it, that makes him a transfer student, just like us. Now that you mention it, yeah, it does. Hello, senpai. Maybe he transferred here out of plain stubbornness. Because he doesn't seem like he's only in it for fun. That might just clear up. All right, let's see if he wants to hang out with us. A celebrity coming to school is already a surprise, but a detective is even rarer. Yeah. You can only imagine what it would be like to go to school with classmates like that. That would certainly make school more interesting. I'm a little curious to see what his family's like, too. There's that and the fact that he's a detective at his age. Oh, speak of the devil. There's the little guy. You don't know the area yet, right? Come on, we'll show you around. There's probably tons of places to hang out that only we'd know about. That won't be necessary. I'm not interested in hanging out, and neither am I interested in you two. Pouts. Huh? Hey, what did you say? That's definitely a sting a bit. What's with that attitude? We're just trying to be friendly. Jeez, way to make an impression. No kidding. Yo, Naoto-kun. How's it going? Oh, um... Hey guys, what's up? Uh, well, we'll be going now. The moment Kanzi comes in, the mood of the hallway changes. And they're gone. That was quick. So we meet again. May I help you? Hey, now, Tokun, if you're not doing anything after school, want to come with us? Come with... you mean me? Perhaps another time. I have some things to mull over. Is that so? Things to mull over? 
I must go straight home today. I promised my grandpa so. Grandpa? Oh well, that's that then. Let's hang out some other time. See you around, Nato. Man, did you see Naoto's attitude? He sure blew his debut at school. Is he gonna be okay at Yasogami? He is different, but he has this mysterious air around him that draws your attention. Whoa, Yukiko, I never knew. You like younger guys? No, that's not what I meant. Hmm. Now Takun said he has things to mull over, but he's got to be talking about the murder case. Most definitely. He's some ace detective, right? I bet he's not satisfied, even though the case is closed. That's true, but... Um... <sighs> this place isn't our special headquarters anymore. It still can be if we want it to be. <sighs> Let's talk about something else. Like what? Isn't the class trip coming up soon? Alright, lad. Um, where are we going? I have no idea. Tatsumi Port Island. Really? I heard it's an artificial island that faces the ocean. It's a pretty big city. Huh? Port Island? Port Island, Tatsumi Port Island is actually the location of where you will be in Persona 3. So we are literally going to be visiting that island. Alright. Nice. I did tons of shoots there. It's just beyond the Moonlight Bridge, yeah? Should be lots of places to hang out there. Uh, actually, we may not have any time to goof off during this trip. What do you mean by that? I heard the school board is changing the trip schedule this year. The idea is we're going to visit a private school there, like to have local and urban students interact or something. It'll be all about studying and serious business. Yuck. Damn. That sounds like a drag. Ugh, they're totally missing the point of a class trip. No kidding. A class trip? This would be about fun, not learning. Period. And we can all agree on that. What kind of place is this private school? I heard it's really good. They have nice buildings and everything. But it's closed on the day we're going there, so they're going the extra mile to make this work. They want us to tour some factories on the second day, and then we're coming back on the third day. What? Where the hell's the free time, eh? That's no different from a social studies field trip. I agree. Uh, I didn't want to know that. Can't expect much from a school sponsored trip, I guess. You've got a point there, Gunsley. Well, we'll be around, so if it starts to drag, we can ditch. I agree. <laughs> we can just ditch. Also, you 
guys around. But we're in different years. Oh, didn't you know? The excursion will be like the campout. They're going to combine the first and second years. Since student enrollment is down and they're low on funds, they've cut the excursion back to once every two years. Well, at least we won't be bored with you around, Senpai. Gosh, I'm trying to remember the last time I went to Port Island and I wasn't working. <laughs> this will be great! I wish I could be that positive about it. Doesn't this seem like a pain in the ass to anyone else? Kind of. But it could be really fun too, man. You never know until we right? Some people were against the proposition, but it's been decided. Oh, and guess whose idea it was? King Morons. Really? It's just the kind of thing he'd come up with. Yeah, I can see that. No, King Moron! Why must you torture us from beyond the grave? No, King Moron! You don't even know who that is. Hey, tell me more about this trip. Where is Port Island? What's there? Get back to work, will ya? Well, even though the class trip is coming up, it's still a ways away. What should I do until then? Hang out with friends. That's the real song you'll sign there. Well, it's not like we got much to do here in the first place. Man is just an animal trying to figure out how to kill time through his days. You ain't wrong there, Tukazu. You definitely ain't wrong there. Most of the time I feel like I'm that way. <laughs> Just trying to figure out how to kill time through his days. That literally seems to be this you, <laughs> if you think about it. sound like you were being philosophical yet it made absolutely no sense makes sense to me sorry <laughs> looks like she lo looks like Yu-Gi-Oh was about to laugh I'm getting them mixed up again <laughs> Of course. There's a delivery for you. Thanks, Nico. Oh, we can hang out with Nico tonight. So we. Hmm. Why not? Yes? Um. Nika looks as if she's not doing anything. Will you spend the evening with Nika? Yes. Yeah. Nika looks happy. You spent a precious moment with Nago. I knew we won't go back up, so I feel that kill a little bit more time for the video. Not much though. You only hear students talking. I feel so tired. Uh, I think I'm that better. 
I feel so tired. Coming to school. So sleepy. I can't believe that I was easily that was only the class every single morning until just about a month ago. You're so lucky. Compared to me, you've been studying for your entrance exams all summer. By the way, I'm so relieved that they caught the guy behind those motors. I was surprised that it was... I was surprised that it turned out to be a student. I've seen so many souls interviewing the police by now. I'm so sick of it. After school. Have the incidents finally been resolved? You can only hope the same. Mm. Transgressions? I'm not sure if that's what that is. Won't be repeated. Hmm. What are you two up to? I don't care what he was better. Hmm. Huh. And then what? Oh, Jordan Kern. Oh, I'm sorry. I wasn't really paying attention. Are you going home now? Take care. It seems Yukiko is absorbed in the conversation. You should leave her alone. So then you see... Oh, sorry. I didn't notice you there. Going home now? Later. It seems she is absorbed in her conversation. You shall leave her alone. The time has come. I have to put it all on the line. It's the number one event for a springing couples, the school trip. This time around, I'm really praying that I get to be in the same group or seat or s no, I'm butchering this. <laughs> I just seat. I was thinking sit. Uh -huh. <laughs> or seat next up it's really can't be for the life of me that series of models seems to be over now and everything's back to normal that's what I thought Anyway, those girls are pretty noisy, aren't they? Huh, the church is still. They're talking about isn't you. Oh, uh, he is a first year student. I get it. They should stop bugging. 
It's either begging or bugging. <laughs> I'm going with bugging. Oh, it's about that then. Did you hear? The model is someone our age, or so I heard. That guy was really weird, like... Like, wrecked out of his mind all the time. They even say so on TV. Uh, you have to be some kind of sicko to do something that terrible. You gave her the charming veil, the charmed veil. Okay, so you are one of the ones we need to find out for, right? It's amazing. I feel different just having this veil near me. Oh, but if I put it on suddenly, I'll stand out and everyone will look at me like I'm crazy. Oh no. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just thinking about myself again, but please take this. And we have five tuskies beautifully wrapped. Really, thank you so much. No problem. Second year, second term. I need to start thinking about the future pretty soon. Speaking of the future, Jordan, can you cook? Not really, honestly. I've been trying to do some more cooking lately, though. Yeah, I really need a lot of cook more things. No. Oh, really? <laughs> I see. I'm taking some classes in that area myself. I'm learning to make sushi. When you wrap it in a... Not so what that is. Anyway, fried egg. It looks so cute. Can you cook? I still sure can. Ah, I see. Maybe you would be good. Hmm, that challenge is so high. What do you mean by that? I thought we were going to call it an episode here. And I'm probably going to split this one into two parts. Mainly just because I want to call the first half the end of summer vacation and the second half back to school. Because that's kind of what this was. <laughs> oh, I feel like having an episode titled both of those things. And until next time, stay golden.